Me, I not seen I'm single. Everybody, I've told everybody I cannot cook. Me, I am. But you cannot go and be with a chef and be a hungry. Yeah, yeah, I can't like that. That's brazy. Uh -huh. That one, the mad meal. It's brazy, it's brazy, it's brazy. See, I'm not a chef, but my man is eating well. Sure, guess. He's even getting fat. That's what happens when you're chasing Toto. Instead of, <laughs> <laughs> instead of quality relationships. Let's talk about jokes and what it means to take a joke too far. Because I'm watching Tofa. Well, can you say the right way? Too far and too far. So I was watching Tofa and Sush talk about the jokes on your camera while in the kitchen. I've been doing the of you know that she's feeling she's frustrated now. Local. If normal as in as a normal thinking person, it's okay, say it's and just free it. It's not that oh like every single time that is what you are marrying on. Every time we come and meet us, that's the same thing. You're talking about the same thing, do you get? And uh, how it was a uh, bad how like the way Tofa took the joke and the way Tofa and Surge tried to pounce on Onyeka because of a joke. I'm like, look at this matured man showing us their real age. <laughs> Where is that side? Chill, chill, chill. Wake up, wake up. You're taking the fucking piss, you know. Is it a problem? Guys, see, being older in age doesn't mean that you are mature. I welcome you to today's video. My name is Shooks, and this is Powerhouse of Positivity. If you are here to become a member of this great community, all you need to do is just make sure that you watch this video to the end. Don't skip on any part. Like this video, turn on your post notifications so you'll be notified whenever I drop a video. And share your thoughts. Share your thoughts because that shows me that you are interested in what I'm saying and we can have a dialogue about the show. So why am I saying jokes and what does it mean to take a joke too far? So during the course of today, Onyeka, Wani X Handy, Sean, and uh, Tofa, and one other lady, I forgot her name, was in the kitchen area. Tofa was hungry, so Tofa was begging for food. And Onyeka was there cooking. So Onyeka kind of made a joke like, oh, how can you be dating or how can you be uh, friends or how can you be in a ship? Let's take that one. How can you be in a ship with a chef and you are always hungry and you are losing weight? If not that you didn't go for Toto, as you already know what Onyeka means by that. If not that you went for Toto, you would have been getting enough food. One on the other side was like, yes, me, I don't even know how to cook. But you see, my man, he's gaining weight and he's eating and he's eating healthy. Oyeka said the same thing. Yes, I'm not a chef, but here I am cooking food and I'm not even in a ship with anybody. And in a way, I kind of laughed, to be honest with you. I laughed when I heard that. Uh, I laughed when I heard Oyeka say that. Because at the end of the day, guys, we know that uh, Nelly has been portraying herself as a chef. And I can count how many times I've seen Nelly in the kitchen. So I kind of understand maybe Onyeka was kind of feeling why is it why is it that the girl that goes by by why is it that the girl that portrays herself to be a chef is not the one cooking for the whole public? Whereas our, our, uh, us that don't even know how to cook or us that don't portray ourselves as chef is the one here in the kitchen 24-7 making sure that everybody is fed. And we have to on the other hand, who is in a way close to Nelly, who is a chef, who hasn't even, like according to Onyeka, losing weight and begging on that house, other housemates to cook for, for him. And I'm like, yes, maybe Onyeka is pouring her anger, pouring her frustration as to, I don't know how to cook, but you guys are making me to cook here all the time. Whereas there's somebody who is a chef, who doesn't even come to the kitchen to cook. So guys, let me know what are your thoughts because why I was watching that and I'm watching Tofa react to it, telling, saying that Onyeka is taking a piece on him, saying that the Onyeka said the joke that, yes, it might be a joke, but at the end of the day, other people said it once and kept quiet. But Onyeka kept on going, kept on going, kept on going. And I'm like, you guys are friends. If I consider you my friend, I have the license to say whatever the hell I want to say to you or to your babe or to anybody. Only person that is out is family. Sometimes we joke with family. As my friend, I can joke with family. I can call your family names. And I require you to do the same to me. Because that's how our bond as friends grow. That's how we mature as, as friends. So seeing Tofa reacting as a kid when he was when a joke was made to him, I'm like, no, Tofa, you need to grow up. You need to grow up. You don't need to be uh, portraying this kind of personality. It's a joke. 
take it. It was Prince that said something about if you can't handle the heat, don't come into the kitchen. You don't come to a show like Big Brother and you don't have it in mind that people are going to throw you. No. People will throw you. Fans will throw you. Imagine what Onyeka said and then how Tofa reacted. So just imagine Tofa comes out and sees his name, see, goes to Twitter and see what people are going to say about him and see how people are, and see what people are saying about him. How will he feel if he can't even take a simple joke from Onyeka? How will he feel now when he comes to the real world and see trolls trolling him on a daily basis? Like, he needs to grow up and he needs to know that it's a joke. But at the end of the day, they finally made up, they talked it out and they hugged it out, which I am happy because this is the kind of sibling ship that we got going in the house and i will not want something to come in between them so guys let me know what are your thoughts do you think that the way tofa had to the whole joke and do the whole uh issue between him and onyeka do you think that is the right way he could have handled it or do you think he could have handled it in a more matured way let me know what your thought are down below and for onyeka do you think onyeka took the joke too far let me know what your thought are down below and i'll see you guys on the next video